Hi, and welcome back. This is a washing dough that you're going to be watching. Um, my hair has been freshly washed with the um, Everclear Conditioning Shampoo, and then I did the Ever Strong Reconstructing Conditioner. Then I placed in some Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner, and then I used Dr. Miracle's um, Invigorating no, fo Follicle Healer. So now I'm applying the the Cantu the Cantu Shea Butter Curling Custard, and my hair was sectioned into five sections, um, and that was the second section. So I'm starting on the third section. Each section um, is I'm uh, subsectioning into three, and then I'm applying a amount of the curling custard. Now I would recommend. Um, just for my hair type, if you've got um, more 4C, when which our curling pattern is not that defined, you will need to use soaking um, wet hair because um, that usually makes our curls pop more than as it dries. It just kind of puffs. So I would definitely recommend um, soaking wet my soaking wet hair. My hair is very wet in this video, but it could be a little bit more. Uh, moisturize as the ends are they're defined but they're a little bit more fluffy than what I would like and so as it dries it will get even more fluffier um, and so just again sectioning it off trying to apply the curling custard from root all the way to the end of my hair um, to get good coverage and to make sure that we have a even um, distribution of the product and hopefully get a nice um, even um, curl pattern throughout. Now you will notice that I do have shed hairs from time to time and I just think that's normal. Um, I always am amazed by other videos how they never have shed hairs but hey I guess you know either they have really good hair or they edit it out. Also make sure that you try to get your um, your edges um, just so that you're, it's not so puffy. My hair in particular has been Texlax, but I am post Texlax at three months. So my roots are very puffy. And so I'm trying to make sure I get the product at the roots so that once it dries, the, my hair is not too, too big. I don't know how successful I am, but we'll see. I don't always, I don't mind too much puffiness. It's just that sometimes with work, it just, people, when I walk in the room, they just feel like, okay, well, her hair is really big. So <clears throat> I do try to make sure I apply the product from root to end so I don't get so much puffiness with the new growth. And this is the end. I think it came out pretty well. I will say with the Cantu Curling Custard, too much product leaves or white residue. These are the results of um, pictures that I took. Now the next pictures will be more pictures of results but also of products used. And I must say I really do like the L'Oreal um, series of products and the Ever Curl um, Nourishing Wash was actually very nice. It didn't dry out my hair. The reconstructor was also nice. Um, everyone knows about Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In, so I don't really need to talk about that. Um, the follicle healer makes your hair feel so nice. It makes your scalp feel very nice and invigorating because of the menthol. And then the curling custard. So those were the products that I used. Um, thank you for watching.